In a town hall, Bernie Sanders claims Donald Trump won because people got sick of political correctness. Bernie's right until he defined what politi politically correct actually means. For years and years, we have been told by Republicans and many Democrats that our trade policy was a great idea, that it was working for America. Well, you know what? The American people don't believe it. They think there's something wrong when just with permanent normal trade relations with China and the Mexican free trade agreement, we have lost some four million decent paying jobs. The American people, I think, want candidates and politicians to have the guts to stand up to the billionaire class and start representing the middle class and working families of this country. I don't think it's more complicated than that. See what he did there? He turned real rebellion against the PC into something about class warfare. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Bernie, it's not about the billionaire class. There are 540 billionaires in America, small oh. class. Oof. But there are thousands of jerks telling us that we're evil. See, the PC rebellion is about a reaction against the media academic complex, which tells us what to say or else. People were tired of the identity wars that pitted young versus old, white versus black, gay versus straight. It's why each time a celebrity feminist lectured us on Trump, mm. Hillary lost more votes. Every time Lena Dunham opened her trap, her causes shriveled, among other things. So it's not about trade or the rich. Industrialists aren't screaming slurs on campus telling us which pronouns are offensive or why Christmas carols are microaggressions. That's the PC movement. Power mad twerps who use reputational smears to brand all of us as evil until we submit. And that's what bugs me about Sanders. He's been a socialist forever, mired in left wing politics for decades, and now he diagnoses the problem. Dude, you are the problem. From the 1970s to now, you cared and you watered this toxic movement. So, Bernie, 2016 was about millions of Americans becoming intolerant of that intolerant class. Let's hope it sticks.